Well, Pamela and I were thrilled to meet Dr. Gilbert, and we were very excited by the work he's doing about access to voting. And we felt this was exactly what we hoped that the initiative and the faculty endowments would, would make happen. So in 2000, voting became a high-level issue in the United States. And it was just by chance. We were at a conference, and the speaker there was t discussing electronic voting. And this individual stood on the stage and said it couldn't be done, there were all these issues. And I looked around at my students and they had this look on their face of just discouragement. And they said, well, we're here getting a PhD and we thought that the PhDs were the people who fixed things. So at that moment I said, you're right, this is what we do, we fix things. So if you're really interested, let's go back to the lab and we'll fix it. And that was the beginning of our work in voting and that's what started Prime 3. So when we designed Prime 3, we had the idea that it have a screen where you could touch it and it have a headset with a microphone where you could respond to it using your voice or sound. Vote. So we said in this scenario, blind people could vote privately as well. So we wanted to test it. We were there at the Alabama Institute for the Deaf and Blind and people were coming in testing it. And then there was this one woman who came and voted. And she kept coming back and she said, uh, this is the first time in my life I've ever been able to vote by myself. So I would like to do this again and again and again. I mean, think about this election day in the United States. It's the one day, the one day when everyone has exactly the same amount of power. It's the great equalizer, election day. And we're thrilled that we could find someone of Dr. Gilbert's caliber, insight, capability to come and do this research at the University of Florida. Our model in our lab has changed the world and those funds are definitely helping us change the world. In the future, everyone's gonna vote on a technology. Either we created it or we designed it. It's definitely inspired by our work. People have died in this country for the right to vote. Look at what we're doing. We're making voting more accessible for everyone.